in a course where you may have certain chapters or modules to ask the kids to go out and find definitions to vocabulary terms, bring those back into the wiki, to find other articles that may relate to this kind of that depth of learning. We want to just kind of centralize all our documents, our meeting times, our project ideas, and contact information. What I finally have had to do is I have to have the wiki to manage the wikis. I know that sounds crazy, but I have them. I have the central wiki, finally, that manages all the other wikis. We have a textbook that we kind of go along with that is kind of very, um, I don't know, it, it has its limitations as a textbook, and uh, it doesn't always make all the connections to all the digital media that's out there. So what I do is I have my students, uh, I assign them portions of chapters that kind of introduce different concepts, and then they use the web to kind of support uh, their ideas. So I'm seeing connections that they're making, um, to the concepts that go beyond our discussions and kind of personalize with their own interests and it just takes the conversation in class to a whole other level. I started off with posting an agenda for our upcoming meeting and asked everyone to go and look at the agenda ahead of time, add things and take things away and it just started growing from there where we would be posting documents we wanted to look at and sharing ideas to consider, asking questions of each other. Um, responding to each other's ideas on the wiki and so when it came time to to meet everyone had a really clear idea about what we were meeting about and had already put some forethought into the things we were going to discuss. Right now they're doing a web design evaluation. They, the semester just started so they're learning new tags for HTML and it's an elective course and um, basically they're learning how to look at websites critically and, and go to a website and know this is a well-designed site this is a site that has purpose for me if I'm uh, doing research. Is it, is it a research site for adults? Is it a research site for kids? So it's trying to get them to use some critical thinking skills. Ultimately, that goes into my assessment at the end of the semester when they do final projects because they're looking at this, at this website saying, this is a good website. Is my website a good website? And the wiki helped them get there. Mm -hmm.